Morning guys, August 25th, 2023. So now I got a call from a customer of mine. Um, his father's AC is not working. So he's an older guy. And I have worked on that system in the past. I believe he's got a Goodman system there. I know he's got a Goodman furnace. I'm not sure what he's got there for AC, but I believe it's probably a Goodman. Anyway, it's not it's not working, so um, I don't know how how old the system is or whatnot. So we're gonna go by there and check it out. See if we can find out why it's not working. See if we can figure it out, fix it for the guy. We'll try to get you some shots when I get over there. Alright, so we got it on inside. It's got a, uh, there's no delay on it because it's a round thermostat. And it's just not cool. Well, it's not on. That's a, that's a capacitor. Yeah. Hear it try to start? Hmm. That's easy fix. Yeah. Yeah, yeah you hear it? Yeah. Try to yeah. start. Uh, How long's this thing been in? It's getting a little. You you put it in. What do you think? You I don't know. It? Must have a date. You did all the plumbing work and the whole deal. It's a thirteen. Yeah, you don't want to. If it's not working, you need to shut it off, right? Yeah. I mean. Don't take flipping rocket scientists to figure yeah. what happens if the fan was bad? You'd yeah. burn the flipping thing out. It's well, not she good. Shut it off, so she, yeah, she needs to shut it off right away. I don't know, I don't get it. Why why are people so they don't they don't they just keep shit running. I mean Does that make any sense? Yeah. Shut it up. Right. No, because what happens if there's something's bad with it? You're gonna burn it up. You don't wanna do that. Capacitor, I know it's bad because I could hear it try to start. At least we didn't have mice. Yeah, 15. It was put in in 15. 15. So that's what, seven years. I put, I, put a, I put in a Goodman because you had a Goodman down cellar. Yeah. I remember you doing all the. Uh... Alright, so I heard it. I heard it definitely. Let's see. Let's see if the capacitor is bad. Most likely. That's what it sounds like to me. Wow. Let's see if it's bad right now. Yeah, I put a, because you got a Goodman furnace downstairs, so I put a Goodman he, out here. The other one was old, remember? Yeah. So we'll check it. But it's, but it's a bad capacitor. It looks a little puffy to me. Let's see what we got here. My father's 97. Yeah, open line. It's no good. See, open line? Oh, yeah. It's no good. So that's an easy fix. Let's see what size it is. Didn't do any other damage in there? Yeah. Shouldn't, no. Yeah, okay. Very good. Easy fixes. Yeah, easy fix is good, right? Busy? Yeah. Yeah, been real busy. I saw you on the road the other day. You know what it is? Is a lot of these these um, these old systems need to be replaced now, and yeah. I mean, you only can milk them along for so long, you know. Sure. And then eventually, let's see, it's puffy. It's a 45.5. That's fine. We'll get another one out of the truck. See how it's all puffy right there? See how it's all puffy? Yeah. No good. Look at all my capacitors. All my capacitors in here. Let's see what we got here.
That's a 40. Forty-five-five here. We got a one that size. Forty-five-five. We can go with a fifty-five-five if I had to. But that's the one. Forty-five-five. Yeah, ninety-seven. I mean, God bless him, huh? He's still, he's still going. Medical problems at that age. And, well, I guess kind of to be expected, right? I mean, you're expected, yeah. 97? Yeah. You're, you know what happens? Your your body's wearing out. It's only made to do so long. Otherwise, yeah. baseball players will play to their, you know, 100 years old. You, right. just, you just can't do it anymore. Yeah, they get worn out. Yeah. Yeah. How are you going to do it? All of a sudden, they release a football player or a baseball player, and they just, they just can't move anymore. Well, usually around 40, I think they're done, right? Yeah, I'm done. Unless I you're would Tom think Brady. so. Huh? Unless you're Tom Brady. <laughs> All right, so the brown is the fan, that's the two pole. Yellow. It's just a compressor. Herm. Hermatic. That's the yellow. That's a three prong. And these other two are the common. And that's a common. And that's the common from the fan. And these two go to the common. You should be able to turn the breaker on and she should fire right up. Right. Other than that, it's been cooling okay? Yeah, it's been alright. Yeah. Alright, let's see if it fires. shuts off and you keep this thing running for two days, you're going to kill it. Yeah. That's why when it don't work, shut it off. Yeah. Tell your sister, if she comes and the air conditioner is not working, to shut it off. That motor stops, this thing will run, it'll be like six, six, seven hundred pounds of pressure in here. Yeah, yeah it ain't going to work, it ain't going to last. Because it's not working, I shut it off, I said good. When she shut it off, shut it off yesterday sometime. Okay. She's only been here uh, two days. You know, just as a rule of thumb, if the thing's not working, don't keep it running. Can you tell if it's cooling or? Huh? Can you tell if it's cooling? Well, there's no thumb in the greatest, is it? You don't know what kind of strain you put on it, but it's, that capacitor helps everything to stop. So leaving the, leaving the power on to it, you, you, you're cooking it. And if you keep the power going to it, it's not starting, it's just cooking away there. You kind of burn it up. Well, I don't think she knew that this wasn't running out there. It doesn't sound good. Seems to be 
be quieting it down a little bit. You want to let it go? The yeah. motor? Okay. You want to let that motor go? It's running. Yeah. You want to let it go, right? Yeah. Well, if it's not working, shut it off. Like I said, if that motor stops working, um, Working the way it sounds. It doesn't sound that great, to be honest with you. Is this the cooling now? Or? I got another motor on the truck if we need yeah, one. Yeah, if you want, come on, go ahead. As long as everything else is okay, the cooling and the making the. That seems to be alright. Doesn't need a charge or anything. That motor's not sounding good, is it? Yeah. See that squeaking? Yeah. I think we should change it. Okay. We're going to have problems if here, not. Here. I mean, yeah, we don't need any problems, right? You need to call your back, right? No, go inside and shut the unit off, shut the thermostat off, and I'll get another motor for it. The Baron, the Baron's making crazy noises in there. That's not good. I don't blame them. Shut the unit off inside and put a little condenser fan motor behind it. Thanks. I got one in the truck, so. Squealing like that, it's a matter of time until it gives up the ghost. I don't want any problems. I know I don't want any problems. Yeah, that's fine. Look at the brown. It's still running in there, but I know it shuts off in another minute or two. The brown, the purple, and then the black. Yeah, I got a motor to fit in there. This, um, how's this hearing? Hearing? Eh, so so. I mean, I, I work for some of these older people, and I mean, they just, they just can't, you try talking to them, and they just don't, they can't hear you, they don't understand, it's really terrible, you know? Yeah, it's mostly they can't hear you, because a lot of them have their mind, and they... They got their mind, but they're just flipping deaf. Yeah. I had one lady the other day, you know, she called me, she got no heat, I know she's got an oil burner. So I said to her, I said, do you have, do you have any oil in the tank? Took me 45 minutes to get through to a, to, to a simple question. I need to know if there's oil in the tank, because if not, you're gonna order oil, right? No, I don't have, I don't have, a, I don't have a, a water in my tank, or I don't have a water tank. I mean, just unbelievable. Well, they should have someone younger that can hear. Well, she, her husband's there, but he was sleeping, so I had to have him, have her wake him up. Get his ass out of bed, right? Well, that's what I do. I can try to. My father can't do it. He can't maybe hear you or understand you. And... Yeah, so it sucks to get old. That's all I can say, right? Yeah. Some of these old people. I mean, it just sucks. What are you gonna do? And there's an old saying: "Getting old is not for sissies." Is that what they said? <laughs> Probably true, huh? It is, and there's, there's a lot of medical stuff and a lot of problems. I mean, you've had some medical problems. You know what it's like. Yeah, but I'm not in my 90s. Yeah, but so multiply that by three or four, and your age is higher. Uh, you're gonna have uh, problems. Yeah, it's not easy. That's and for you sure. gotta, I mean, when it's hard to get out of bed every day. <sighs> 
and get out of bed, no problem, right? Yeah, and you get older, it's not as easy, yeah. huh? So you have that problem, and then you have some just walking problem, because you can't walk like you used to. Look at that shit. Come on. Yeah. Worth more money. Yeah, it's just, I mean, it's just flipping things hot. Just get, well, let's change it before we have all kinds of, you're gonna, it's not going to last that yeah. much longer anyway. It's hot, so. you feel it, yeah. Not when it's making noise like that. Let's, time to go. They're on their way out. Get on the way out. Luckily, I caught it before it got too bad. People make fun of Goodman, but they they run. Nothing wrong with them. They all break. They all break down. Nothing lasts forever. Yeah. But your marriage. No. <laughs> right? That's it. That's what you say, huh? Oh, are you still you, married? Yeah. You didn't get married again. No, one time was it for that me. Was, that was it, huh? One time was enough for me. No girlfriends or anything? Well, yeah, I get girlfriends, but they don't last too long. Well, why don't you tell them up front you want to get married, so... <laughs> Girls that want to get married all the time. Getting married is fine. It's the divorce part that sucks. <laughs> right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ain't that the truth, though? There's some nasty ones out there. <laughs> yeah. What's the marriage like? $50? Oh, yeah. It's, then... the, it's the divorce part that sucks. Yeah. <laughs> Looking funny, huh? Uh, True, though. Yeah. How long have you been divorced? Long time. 28 years. Oh, yeah. How old's your daughter? She's 35. 35, huh? Yeah. I... I got divorced when she was seven. Yeah. So. I remember I, when I met you years ago, your daughter was very young. So. Yeah, she used to come to work with me all the time, remember? Yeah, I think I do. Yeah, because yeah. I used to I used to take yeah. pick her up every weekend. Yeah. So yeah, I do back in the day, I, you know, I'd be working and she'd be coming to work with me. Wow. Uh, 35. That shit don't happen anymore. I mean, she's, she's old now. She's got her own. Oh shit going on. Yeah. They got their own stuff going on, huh? Gotta take this plug out here so it, if any water gets in there, it drains out. See that little plug? Yeah. That's gotta come out. No, if you get married to the right one, there's nothing wrong with it. Yeah. As long as it can make it work. Oh, well, marriage is give and take. One person wants to take more than the other, they have problems. Yeah, it's going to be a give and take, right? I mean, yeah, no one's yeah, perfect, but... that's for sure. Yeah, I only, my, my first marriage wasn't the greatest, so. Yeah. Uh, I, I get cold feet really easy. Mm. I'm really not much into the cold weather. <laughs> yeah, <like> <laughs> 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 I'm not into the cold weather. No. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. Did your ex-wife get remarried? Or? Yeah, she did. She did, yeah. Well, some people you see, they get married. I got a good friend in Ohio who grew up, married four times. Wow, four times, huh? Yeah. God bless him. Yeah. And here he is, my age, no money. Four times? Yeah. Yeah, see, that's what happens. I, he's lost houses, yeah. he's lost cars, he's lost everything. He just keeps going, he keeps needing... Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. She probably wasn't the, the greatest. Big shot though. to his wife. I <laughs> guess her she, attorney. She wasn't the greatest, huh? Yeah. He didn't yeah. want to live with her. So, the kid was uh, 12 years old in court. They said, uh, who do you want to live with? He said, my father. <laughs> and he said, what? <laughs> Oh, he wasn't, he wasn't even expecting it. No, he wasn't expecting it. Neither was his wife and his uh, lawyer. Her wow. Lawyer, her lawyer. So he brought the kid up for 20 years. And the kid's his best friend, and he lives with him. He helps him out. And wow, ain't that's kind of cool, though. So huh? that worked out good. So he wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Son he of a said, gun, huh? He said my uh, wife and her lawyer almost fell off the chair. <laughs> Did he laugh? Because the judge says to the boy, well, well, who would you like to live with? And he goes, my father. And they said, what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, the kid was uh, they weren't expecting that, huh? No. It was, I guess when a kid's 12 years old, they can choose. Oh, they can? Yeah, they ask him. They ask him. Well, that's kind of cool, yeah, though, huh? That's kind of interesting, yeah. Mm. They think he's old enough to say, you know. And, so, and that's good, in a way, because sometimes maybe... The father's better to him than the mother, or the mother's better than the father. And oh, so uh, the, the, the wife wasn't expecting him to even ask? No. Funny. You go to family court, I guess you don't know what you're going to get. You're crazy. Like I said, I'm not against the marriage thing, but it's going to be yeah. it's gonna be right. I mean, I'm not... Unknown marriage is fine, but the divorce part sucks. Yeah. And I got, you know... Yeah. That's hard. I'm not stupid. I got too good of a life to be yeah. lose everything. Look at him, he's got nothing, right? Oh yeah. He had a house, he had cars, he had you know, we had good jobs, but you know, just Is he gonna uh, get married again? After the fourth one? That was the last one with the child? No. <laughs> he said no. He said no more? No. No. Then I hear from him sometime and I said, How you doing? He goes, Oh, I met this girl and this and I said, Read my lips. No new girlfriend. Don't get married this time. Don't get married again. He knows. Yeah. It's funny, the three other marriages he had, you know, one lasts like seven years, one ten, you know, one fifteen. It lasted a while, yeah, right? Yeah, it wasn't, uh, so they lasted a while, that's right. Four times, wow. But the fourth one, he had the child. He didn't have children in the first three, which so is good, I guess. That's what you call a four-time loser. Yeah. <laughs> Right? Yeah. He laughs about everything, so... Does he? He doesn't take anything too serious. I guess when you get four divorces, you know, <laughs> you lose all your money. And then he's got medical problems now, you know. What, diabetic? Oh, uh, he's got, yeah, all kind of problems. He's got some kind of a nerve disease and affects his legs. He has no feeling in him. Holy shit. Yeah. When he had cancer, he got to get rid of the cancer. Yeah, but they give you all kinds of chemo and yeah, bullshit, yeah, and that, kill, that kills all your flipping nerves and yeah, stuff, I it, think. it messed them up, too. But he, he's getting along. But, you know, like I say, when you get old, it, it's bad enough being old, but without medical stuff. Yeah. I mean, you never know, right? I mean, you're going along fine, you think everything's good, life's going along, and all of a sudden, you, boom, you get this flipping whatever. Happens to a lot of people. How about your kid? Is she still um, at that pl at, yeah, at the house, or is she yeah, with the dogs and all that stuff? Yeah. yeah, but she got divorced. Oh, she did? Yeah, she still has her two dogs, though. <laughs> yeah, she was she was young. Yeah, well, she's in her forties now, mid forties. But like you said, you know, you never know marriage. Well, like you said, do the best you can, and yeah. 
What else are you gonna do? What the? Yeah, nobody wants to go through a divorce. Yeah. That sucks. I mean, I, I've been through that myself. I had a buyer out and all that shit. Yeah. They usually start off, oh, they don't want nothing, and the lawyers get them, and next thing you know. Yeah. You know? Yeah, they want everything. They're getting a lot more than what they wanted at first. Yeah. That's what happened to me. business when you got divorced? No, I didn't actually. No, you didn't. No, no she didn't want she didn't want me to go. I was in the union. She didn't want me to go on my own. Ah. That's a, one of the reasons why I got rid of her. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ah. What kind what union were you in? Where'd you work? I was in the plumber's play for this union. Ah. Yeah. She didn't want me to go on my own. She was worried that I wasn't gonna be able to make it. Ah. So get rid of her ass. Nothing wrong with the union, but I mean, you don't always work. No. And same thing when you're on your own, too. Sometimes you're not working a little bit, but yeah, but as long as you have enough business, you'll be okay. Yeah, that's what happened. I ended up. The kind of business you have is a, a very demand. I business. built, I built my business up and yeah. started it from scratch. And yeah. Yeah. Well, she wouldn't. She, she didn't want it. Yeah. Your, your business isn't going to go out of style. No. She didn't have faith that I could make it. Uh, it's not easy. No, it's not easy. Most don't make it. It's hard. You gotta, you gotta balance a lot of things. Most won't make it. You know that. Yeah. All right. How many businesses start. you see where they start up and years later off, they're gone? Start off slow and work your way up, right? Yeah. Stop a Goodman. Look, the pots are going way up. Holy shit. Yeah. What I used to pay for pots and yeah. what I pay for them now, ridiculous. Yeah, everything's going up. You're used to paying so much for something, and then all of a sudden now it's doubled. Kind of pisses you off. Yeah. No, it does to me. Not much I can do about it, but. You need the pots, you gotta buy them, right? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You pay so much for something. Now all of a sudden it's uh Plumbers. twice the price. Everything's kinda of really mm. It's not fun. that you don't buy the shit then you don't have it when you need it then what well you might buy it before the price goes up more well let's just get it in inventory it's like how much how much stuff you're gonna buy like burn oil burner nozzles like you go through a lot of them yeah so you know I buy a couple of boxes at a time different sizes and then when I'm out of them, I gotta buy more, and it's like, holy shit, it's gone up that much again? Yeah. It's really, uh, 
Any shortages of anything? No, not really. No, no shortages. Most We've been able to get stuff. Sometimes they uh, say, oh, there's a shortage. Well, if you don't have shortages of food, I guess you'd be okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they talk about that shit, too. What happens then? What happens if you lose, um, the, the grid goes down, you got no power. That yeah. would really suck. Huh? That's happened, huh? Well, it can happen. It can happen then what again. do you do? Yeah. My uh, cousin lives in Texas. They had a big problem down there. Got real, c or last winter, rather. Oh yeah, okay, cold, yeah. And they yeah. Were, he had a problem when that when it was really cold. Yeah, well, no one had power for a long time. Yeah, they were they were using the uh, windmills or something, and yeah. something happened, and so they, they didn't have no backup or something, right, something stupid. Dallas, huh? yeah. He so, said, uh, "I said you have power." He goes, "Well, we have it for a few hours." How long did and, he lose it for? Yeah, this went on for about a week. Wow. Yeah. A week. I said a few hours. He goes, yeah, we'll get it. And then it, then it goes down again. I said, oh boy, how do you how do you plan? For this? Oh, he ended up getting he ended up he's, he's getting old now, my dentist. He ended up getting the shakes. Uh, so um, can't do that. Who's your dentist? He didn't want to retire, but he had no choice, right? I mean, yeah. you can't have the flipping shakes and be a dentist, can you? No, you can't. No, unfortunately. My dentist. Uh, and he was a good guy, it. awesome person, but he just getting old can't can't do that who the hell is gonna you're gonna be drilling to someone's mouth and you got yeah. the flipping shakes yeah. no good right same thing with surgeons doctors they uh, at some point they can't do it because their hands shake so you got to turn oh, it over. okay same thing huh same thing yeah I know a lot of doctors are surgeons for years and then there's some point they say well I don't do surgery anymore. because of that reason yeah and they know what was happening Imagine you're a brain surgeon and you're shaking your hands. Yeah, you can't. You can't do it. Imagine the trouble you get into. Yeah, so that's what happened to him. Unfortunately, yeah, uh, got the flipping shakes. And I could see it happening because I do the guy's plumbing, you know. And uh, he'd call me to fix something. Next thing I know, I see him shaping like a flipping leaf. One of his hands going like a flipping, like a leaf. I says, oh, yeah. that ain't good. Mm -hmm. You get a new dentist then? Or? Yeah, I ended up getting someone else. So. I mean, it's not his fault, right? Yeah. It's, uh, just kind of sucks. Mm -hmm. What are you going to do? He didn't want to retire, but it's like, you got no choice now, guy. Then his son tried taking over, yeah, his but his son did. couldn't do everything. His son, his, his son's running the place in, in a couple of towns over, and he's trying to run, he's trying to run two places at once. He just can't. I mean, yeah. can't run, and then you can't find anybody. This black goes to black. You can't find anybody to work for you. No. The two brown, and then this is the this is the fan that goes on a common. This yellow goes on a common. So he had a he had to retire. He didn't want to. All right, that goes on a common, which is this red one here. Well, the same as this red one. Same thing. Goes here or here, same thing. I mean, these two. I'm gonna go up here. One's for the fan. That's the fan. This other one, we could cap it or put it on a common, one of the two. This one with the white wire is the same as the yellow. Goes to the same place on the... i just put that one on the common terminal. And she should fire. 
should run. See if it starts. <laughs> Let me turn it on. Yeah, you're gonna have to turn it on inside. Right. Yeah, she's blowing out the right direction. It's blowing out the right direction, so that's what we want. heat out of here we're nice and cold coming out that's good that's what we want 